TFNN Headline News Update. Good Monday morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Monday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell, and we got markets in positive territory across the board. We have crude trading up a dollar this morning. We have the gold contract, negative $4. Let's kick it off with the NASDAQ 100. Right now, you're, excuse me, 96 points. When you talk about the lows, we were actually lower overnight, 15,405 at about 1 a.m. Eastern Time, actually dipping below the lows we had, closed it, essentially the lows, of the day on Friday across the board, and we've climbed back right to, interestingly enough, kind of the intraday lows that we had on Friday's action. That price level in the NASDAQ, 115,533, up about two thirds percent or 100 points. And so we're trading at 44.78. Dow's up more than 200 points right now. All the indices, pretty much percentage-wise, right in line in terms of a, just about six tenths percent. Uh, and the Dow, you're talking about six tenths percent trading at 34,703. Dow chart struggling a bit to come up. There you are. And then you have tenths percent. So pretty close to in line in terms of where you are. Bitcoin right now, you're trading down $500 at 44,000. 585. You see the sell off last Tuesday kind of chopping around near the lows of that level. And as I mentioned, crude higher. Look at that acceleration. Thursday, we're at 67.56. Friday's action was 69.50. We're about a dollar higher at 70. 78 was the high today. We put this thing on a daily. And you'd see, I mean, we're basically trending towards the higher range on crude, about $74 to $76, somewhere in that area. Gold contract backing off a bit, down about $3, back to a 15-minute chart. Gold trading at $17.88. We jumped to silver off $0.48 cents this morning at $23.43. And notes and bonds, a little bit of higher price. The 10-year up three ticks at $133.08. 30-year, excuse me, up 10 ticks at $163.01. We had some CPI data out this week tomorrow, I believe. We'll see how that hits the market. Uh, markets right now, though, positive territory as we kick things off. Let's jump around to some of the FANG stocks this morning. We got Amazon shares trading higher by about $15. We'll jump to Apple, talk about some volatility uh, on Friday. Apple losing the case in one aspect with Epic. Well, we'll get into this a little bit more because they might have to offer the ability for those payments uh, off of their app, but really Epic was fighting for in-app access and I don't think they got it. Nonetheless, Apple trading lower on Friday. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be coming back for the Morning Market Kickoff. Live programming all day at TFNN. We'll be right back.